start loving yourself. And yes, it's okay in, in places like this not to be okay, but it's also okay to be okay. It's okay to be good. It's okay to be happy. It's actually okay to be happy. And when you are happy, like the, like the shortage of the water, fill every saucepan that's inside you. <laughs> every saucepan that's inside you and let it flow over that. It's okay to be okay. It's actually okay to be happy. So when you go down here, lads, don't stuff the tormentors. Let it off with the wind. Let it off with, let it, let it off with the mountains. Let it off every place. Just do this, not for me. This is for myself. Will you do this evening? Please do it for yourself this evening and start. Don't start tonight. Start now. Start now. Get a grip of the heart and soul inside your very being of who you are. The important, great person that you are to love yourself. And God, when you can love yourself and it's overflowing, then you can love everybody else. So we your two eyes yourself this is for yourself just to close your two eyes and listen to the ocean and I want in the first time just in the first minute that you will bring something into your heart and soul to forgive yourself call out your own name John or Joe or Mary or Jack and say I forgive myself for what I have done or what I haven't done or what was said to me or something I said or something I didn't say just call out your name and say, I forgive myself. <laughs> and then after about two minutes, that's the person that has hurt you most in the world, the person that has hurt you most in the world, by, by uh, no talk now, as anyone, no talk, no talk. The person that has hurt you the most by live, living, life, love, money, friendship, land, houses, hurt, job, has somebody hurt you? Is there somebody, is there somebody, you know, that's strong enough to say, look, I'm a bully. And before you ask somebody, are you a bully, am I a bully? Has somebody hurt you at work? Has somebody hurt you at home? And ask them, ask yourself to forgive them. Say, look, call out their name and say, look, Mary or John or Joe or Jack, I forgive you for what you said to me. I forgive you. And then lads, just think the sea is coming over you, or the river, or wherever you are. And John don't know who you would call it. Washing all down stuff the tormentors out. Let it down through your body, all down through your body, and let it out your toes. And John, you say, don't take it back. It's time to get rid of it. It's time to be free. Now is the time to be free. Be strong enough to somebody and lay your hand on their shoulder and say, look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what I did to you or what I said to you. And you're strong enough to do that and be and to forgive somebody. So yes, we want no word, not one word now, lads, for about three minutes. 